Hi, everybody. I'm Brad Nessler, and I'm with Kirk Herbstreet here in the booth. And we're also joined by our sideline reporter, Aaron Andrews. Thanks for tuning in to tonight's game, brought to you by ESPN and EA Sports. We'll see the All-Americans and the Spartans. BCS National Championship game. This one's for all the marbles, folks. The battle for supremacy. The big enchilada, if you will. Quarterback fans, rejoice. We've got a great one here today. This guy's basically a running back who can throw the football. That's how fast he is. Empty backfield. Quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. He has some room. And he's tackled at the 40. He drops back. Looks left, picked off. At the 30, to the 20, to the 10. And a huge touchdown play. So a great play by the defender to give his team six points. That was a very good play, and that will certainly help build his team's momentum. Quick pass, intercepted. Tackle around the 33-yard line. Big play there by the defense. That's their second pick of the half. This will be about a 46-yard field goal attempt. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and it sails through the uprights. If they can play sound football from here out and make a few plays, there's no reason they can't get back into this. Pass incomplete. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. Scoops up the loose ball. There's another fumble. They come out in a five-wide set. Gets it. He's in space. He's tackled around the 22-yard line. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. Come out in a five-wide set. Back to pass. This one's going deep to the end zone. And he's all the way in for the touchdown. Excellent play here by the quarterback, making the proper reads and finding his playmaker for the score. They got great concentration from everyone. But here's the drive summary to recap what just happened. We're through one here in the national championship with our score, the Spartans, 17, the All-Americans, nothing. Oh, and he had some steam on that throw. Newton, back to throw. Down the sideline. He goes down at the 15-yard line. It takes an incredible amount of accuracy to throw the ball that high and that far. Just a beautiful pass. We'll take a break while the injured players attended to. After that injury, we'll get to see the backup quarterback here. Way to look it in. Nice pick. And it's right down the middle. He's looking to pass. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Caught out in the open. Brought down at the 27. Moore steps back to pass. And he will score. The wideout here truly knows what he has to do to contribute to make his team successful. 
Let's take a glance at the drive summary. One half complete in our national championship. The score at the break is the Spartans, 17, the All-Americans, 10. Passes in and it's picked off by the safety. He's taken down at about the 41. Another interception by this defense and their sideline is really fired up. Gives it off. Makes it out to about the 23. He really showed some good speed there. I'll tell you, no question. When you talk about being able to turn on the Jets and leave everybody in the dust, you have to mention this young man. He's got skills, but his speed is what the pro scouts are drooling about. Kicks away. And he's got it. Throws right, intercepted. Brought down at the 28-yard line. And just a great interception by the cornerback. Well, that's big time. He made a great read on the quarterback and got in there for the pick. At first, they were concerned he suffered a fracture, but he has now been downgraded to a bruised ankle. He's listed as probable to return to the game. Brad, back up to you. Thanks for the update, Aaron. And did that play ever develop nicely? And now we're going to take a look at the drive summary. We are one quarter away from crowning the national champs. Our score through three, 27-10. Moore steps back to pass. He's taken down around the 44-yard line. And I got to think this defense has this quarterback a little bit confused down there. That was his third interception. Pulls it in, and that's a first down. I'll tell you something. I'm loving this quarterback's confidence more and more as this game goes on. He's really throwing the ball with some purpose. He'll get it again. Walker gets another handoff. Gets out to around the nine. It's great when a running attack comes through for the first down like this. It makes an offense so much more versatile. And the ball game's over. And our final score in this one. The Spartans, 27. The All-Americans, 10. Time to enjoy another look at Reese's Perfect Play of the Game. Brought to you by Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. The perfect combination of chocolate and peanut butter. Herbie, what do you got for us? What a year of college football and what a year it's been for our national champs. They showed more heart and determination than any team I've seen in a long time. There were doubters during the season, but they continued to prove everybody wrong. Now they're down on the field as the number one team in college football. My congratulations to everybody on the team. They showed the nation what it takes to be number one. For the Spartans, they continue their run in a perfect season. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 11. Thanks for being with us. For my partners, Kirk Herbstreet and Aaron Andrews and EA Sports, Brad Nessler saying goodbye.